Hi, I'm Jody from Simply Fresh. Today's video is all about making your own vinaigrette dressing. It's easier than you think and it's so much healthier than the stuff you're going to get from the stores. Last week on the blog, I did a couple of postings on summer salads. There was an Asian slaw salad, there was a dill potato salad, and a cucumber coleslaw that'll knock your socks off. If you want to see them, go to www.simplyfreshottawa.wordpress.com. You're sure to love it. The site's full of interviews, restaurant reviews, and recipes. It's really fun. Okay, getting to our vinaigrette dressing. If you don't have a little container like this, which is so handy to just shake up your dressing and put it on, fine. You can make it in a bowl, you can make it in a mug, anything you have, it'll work. Don't worry. I'm going to start with the oil. I like two parts oil to one part vinegar or any other kind of acid like lemon juice or anything you have. So I like two parts oil and it's as simple as this. I'm going to put two fingers here and I'm going to start pouring the oil in. Simple, simple, simple. Now you don't have to use olive oil. I'm using olive oil right now. It's coming out a little slow so I'm going to speed it up for you. But, you know, get adventurous. Try something like a like a sesame oil, very delicious, very flavorful oil. You can even try flavored olive oils, very tasty. Today I'm actually using a flavored vinegar. Uh, this is an oregano vinegar with some oregano from my garden last year that I just put into the bottle with a little bit of white wine vinegar. It sits, it's absorbed the flavor into the, into the vinegar, and it's really tasty. So now I'm going to put my third finger on, and then that way I know that it's roughly a 1 to 2 ratio. And there you have it. You can stop there if you like, but I think this is really the time to get adventurous. This is the time to make your dressing something really special. So add something to it. Add a little bit of herbs, add a little bit of flavor. I'm going to add a little bit of maple syrup and a little bit of mustard. It's going to be tasty, a little sweet, a little tangy. It's going to be delicious. But really, just go nuts. Just try something new. You know, if it sounds good in your head, try it. What's the worst that happens? It maybe doesn't taste as good as you would hope for. You can either just suck it up and use it, or you can toss it out and try again. There's no need to stick to the same old, same old. So I'm going to add about a tablespoon of mustard. Yeah, I need more mustard. And just a teaspoon of the syrup. I like my dressings a little sweet. Give it a shake. If you had a bowl, this is where you would whisk it with a fork or a whisk. Don't shake your bowl. And most important of all, give it a taste. This is the time to do it, not when it's already on your salad. Mm. It's sweet, but herby and very, very tasty. And look how easy that was. Just as easy as going to the fridge and opening a bottle, but you made it on your own with no preservatives, and it's delicious and healthy, and just what you need to start enjoying some of those summer salads. See you next time on Simply Fresh.